is too good to be true. Exactly what Ford says. This is Bill Cannon here at Awesome Engines, and uh, me and Joey Gladstone just dynoed a 500 and, I'm sorry, not a 500, a 460 cubic inch motor, which it's an original Ford Motorsport motor, and um, had a main bearing problem. We fixed it, and uh, we just basically put a new set of pistons in it and played on it, and it went 552 horsepower with all the Cobra Jet stuff, exactly how Ford shipped it to the customer at 5550. It did 585 foot-pounds of torque with a uh, 1,000 CFM Dan Best carburetor. We did change the manifold, and uh, we put a uh, Elderbrock uh, RPM air gap on it. That's the only thing we've done in an MSD distributor. So it did 552 rated right at 5550, which is perfect. And uh, I'll give you a little look-see at it. The carburetor is a Dan Best 1,000 CFM, no spacer. I know I can make 10 more horsepower if I had a spacer on it. It's got the Ford Racing valve covers. It's got a small header tube. It's only an inch and three quarter. That's all I got for a 460 with that bolt pattern. Uh, it's got a funny box style oil pan. There's nothing trick here, guys. This is just a really nice 460. Well, it's a 468 cubic inch motor. It is 60 over. It was 30 over right from Ford SO, S, SVO when he bought the motor. And... Uh, we, we took it a little bit bigger. I think we took it 40 over. But anyway, it's forged pistons. It's a Ford cast crank. They're rods. Um, Speed Pro forged pistons. It's got their hydraulic roller in it. Everything's dead on like it was. Hope you had fun looking at it. See ya.